After finishing our poultry duties, it was time to move to the farm. My cousin and niece were excited to try something new. Uh, that is watering our kales, managu and spinach. Farming doesn't end in the coop. The vegetables also need attention. They quickly joined my colleague, helping him connect the outlet pipe to ensure uh, water could easily flow into the farm. Uh, this teamwork makes farming more enjoyable and they were clearly enjoying themselves. The rest of the team worked on assembling the pump while the outlet pipe was ready. Another colleague ensured the inlet pipe was well positioned inside the river. A few buckets of water uh, were also added into the pump to help it prime before uh, starting. Setting up uh, irrigation takes patience, but it's a skill every farmer should learn. Come on. 
Once the pump was started, it became clear it needed servicing. The thick smoke from the exhaust is a sign that oil needs changing and the engine uh, requires uh, maintenance. A well-serviced pump saves fuel, lasts longer, and delivers better pressure. Farming equipment, uh, just like animals, need care. As soon as the pump began running, my cousin and niece dashed to the farm to check if water was coming out. Uh, they were excited to see water flowing uh, through the pipe, though the pressure wasn't as strong as usual, but still they happily joined in, you know, helping move the pipe uh, to water our kills. Farming is about adapting. Even when things don't work perfectly, we find ways to make it happen and it's very important to even teach them uh, at their early age that sometimes it's not perfect but we must find ways to make it to perfect it right
at first the water pressure coming out of the pipe was so strong that I could barely hold it. I even almost felt trying to help control it. That's farming for you. Sometimes nature shows you just how powerful it can be. But later things changed. The pressure wasn't as strong as it could be. Uh, the reason being some leaks were still present even though Fundis had temporarily sealed them earlier. That meant water was escaping before reaching the crops. Uh, while temporary fixes can buy us time, they are not long-term solutions. We'll eventually need a permanent fix, either replacing the weak sections of the pipe or upgrading our irrigation system. Who knows? <laughs> Farming teaches resilience. Uh, when one solution fails, you find another. Okay? At the end of the day, even with the challenges, my cousin and niece were proud to have been part of the irrigation process. Farming is not always smooth, but teamwork makes it lighter. They learned uh, that every stage of farming, uh, poultry or vegetables, requires effort, patience and persistence. And while our pump and pipes need more work, today they gained hands-on experience they'll never forget. Here at Chola Farm, we believe in teaching the next generation not just how to farm, but how to face challenges with creativity. Farming is a journey, and every day is a lesson. Till next time, see you in the next one. Thank you.